Kissable lips is a right. <laughs> well, we're not going to get too, too close this morning. <laughs> you never know. We're you can offended. get cold, right? <laughs> but joining us in our studio is our guest, Dr. Bruce Katz. And Dr. Katz is with Juva Skin and Laser Center here in Manhattan. And you're going to help us determine what we need to know in terms of the elements that will obviously affect our skin conditions during this time of the year and what we need to do to make sure that they're certainly uh, in, in good shape, right? Kissable, yes. Why Very do you want to say Who's kissing? I haven't met you yet. So. I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Doctor, first of all, Dave has been saying all morning long that it's going to start to get very, very cold uh, next week, like 42 degrees being the high, mm -hmm. so we need to really start paying attention to that. Should we start to maybe apply Vaseline or some kind of um, chapstick on our lips? Is that what's going to treat it? Yes, yeah, so this, this time of the year, because the change in weather, people not realizing that the skin generally gets drier, we often neglect our lips, and it's important to start lubricating them on a regular basis. Particularly if you're outdoors a lot, sure. wear a sunscreen. People forget that too, because you're outdoors and you may be skiing. Sun reflects off the snow, right. and the lips are susceptible to sun damage. All right. So what do we need? Most of these, are, I think, are over-the-counter products, are they not? Right. And well, you can often start with an over-the-counter lubricant. These lip balms all vary. Some are lubricants. Some are actually sunscreens only, and others are medications. Some are combinations of all of them. Can you point to us which is which? Yeah, we'll try well, some of them. <laughs> okay. Some of these chapsticks or the Blistex products, they're just good moisturizers. Some have sunscreen, some don't. Mm -hmm. um, some actually have medications. They may have hydrocortisone in them. Now, what's alpha hydroxy? Does, th does that help out? Well, the alpha hydroxy acids are a new ingredient that you often see in the lip balms. And they're really good for creating exfoliation on the skin or the lips. They help some mild sun damage, too. But for people who have really severe sun damage on the lips, we often use more aggressive treatments like lasers at our Juva Skin and Laser Center. We'll often just completely laser mm. the lip if you have severe sun damage or precancers. Well, what kind of process is it exactly, and does it hurt? Well, we numb the lips. So uh -huh. you really, we put a little bit of cream on, and the laser beam just goes right over the damaged wow. lips, clears them up beautifully. But prevention, really of course, we've got to take care of that. That's the most important part. Absolutely. Now, do you recommend that are there are certain people, I am one of them, who every year gets a cracked lip. At a certain point in the year, I think when the temperature goes down, my lip cracks. Is there anything we can do sure. about that? Yes. Well, cracking of the lips is really the, the severe sign of, of dry lips and that the fact the skin is really drying out in that area. So in order to prevent that from happening, just using a lubricant on a regular basis will prevent that. There we go. If they right. don't heal, then you really need to see a dermatologist. Dr. Bruce Katz, we thank you so much. In fact, you are, of course, a dermatologist right here in Manhattan at the Juva Skin and Laser Center, so we can always contact you should we have any of those kinds of problems. Oh, if pleasure. not, we'll just take our over-the-counter medications. <laughs> right? Thank you so I much. I feel so kissable all of a sudden. Oh, I, <laughs> Queen Latifah, what's up? <laughs>